Uh, big question really going into this, among the big questions, I guess I should say, whether or not Sitter Khaled Holmes is going to be able to. Jonathan Harrison has practiced all week long. We think we'll see Jonathan in this game tonight. Yeah, yeah, he should get the start at center, and it's just another move that we've seen on this offensive line. We've seen fluctuation all season long in a number of different positions. Going in, we thought that Jack Newhart was going to be the right tackle. Right. Then he got moved inside, and so now another move at center. A lot of movement. Hopefully we see some consistency tonight. Had an opportunity to sit down with the second-year pro out of Ohio State, Jack Newhart. True Really a jack of all trades with the Colts. Before we get started, I just want to make sure you're comfortable here, that you don't want to move down a couple of spots or, you know, from like right tackle to left guard. No, you think you're, you're, you're good. I mean, besides, I don't know how much this chair is holding, this chair is holding specifically, <laughs> but uh, it should be all right. You might need some reinforcements yeah. a little bit. How has the transition been? You go to camp, right tackle, you're working on that, and then they move you to left guard, which is kind of where you were last year. Yeah. You seem much more comfortable. Is that accurate? Yeah, you know, whatever I can do to help the team win is, is what I'm going to do. And obviously, I guess there is a little bit of a comfort factor going back over there just because I played so much left guard last year. And um, being next to Anthony, I guess, you know, you know, who's a great player, is definitely adds a little something. So um, I enjoy playing right tackle. I enjoy being on the field. Fans that don't understand the offensive line, because it's a team within the team. Yeah, yeah. You know, it's it's one of those groups where other guys on the team, I think, sometimes kind of look at us out of the corner of, corner of their eye and say, "Wow, those guys, they're that's a group of weirdos right there." And it's kind of it's kind of like we have our own, you know, language and herd mentality, and we always travel together and we have each other's back. So it's, it is a funny group. I think everywhere, every team I've ever been on the O line is like that. So I think it's universal. But um, you know, I'm definitely an O lineman all the way, and I just I love. Being part of that that unit, so it's awesome. The last thing, tough time right now, obviously for the team. Yeah. What's it take to get over this here and get something rolling? You know, obviously we don't have the wins that we want, and um, you know, at the end of the day, that's all that matters in, in an organization. So, the, the good news is we have a great locker room of guys and leadership um, that can get us through this, and we can't let this thing implode. And I don't think that's the mentality we're taking. So. Uh, you know, there's a lot of love in that locker room, and, and we'll get through this. Love talking to Jack. Here's the th love talking to Jack, and here's the thing. If Collin can't go, Jonathan Harrison's going to start at center. We believe Muhort will be the backup center if You're something right. happens to, to Harrison. <laughs> and if something then happens to Muhort, then it's either going to be Michael yep. or me playing yep. center. 